Welcome everyone to Ohio University. Since becoming the first institution of higher learning in the Northwest Territory in 1804, Ohio has been the place where trailblazers and leaders learn how to advance their careers and communities. As a top tier research university, vibrant cultural hub, and leader in experiential learning, that proud legacy continues today. Ohio University is located in Athens, named one of the nation's best college towns. This place is awesome. The iconic red brick paths, stone gateways, and leafy streets combine to create a classic yet one-of-a-kind collegiate home that stays with Bobcats for life. I'm your host, Alex Boylan, and over the next half hour, we'll meet up with 10 Ohio students at various spots across this gorgeous campus to hear their stories and how each one became Forever Ohio. Welcome to Ohio University. This is the College Tour. Let's head over to meet Ian. He found the perfect blend of academics, creative pursuits, and outdoor adventures right here at Ohio, which makes him the ideal person to tell us why Bobcats say there's something about Ohio and Athens that makes it special. Take it away, Ian. Thanks for the introduction, Alex. I grew up in Delaware, where I spent most of my time building, designing, and studying machines. I also developed a bit of a passion for film. So when it came time to pick a college, I wanted to find a place that would not only help me grow as a person, but also develop my technical skills and creativity. As soon as I arrived at Ohio University, it was love at first sight. In addition to being named one of the nation's most beautiful campuses, Ohio offers so much to do. It's no wonder Athens was named one of the best college towns in the nation. Our outdoor scene here is incredible, whether you're hiking local trails or rock climbing at nearby parks. And when it gets chilly, stop by one of our local award-winning coffee shops to help ward off the cold. Plus, you're never more than five minutes from one. As an engineering technology and management student within the Russ College, I've gotten everything I wanted out of an engineering program and so much more. Russ places a huge emphasis on hands-on learning, which I really value. Plus, once you learn the basics of a process, like coding, welding, or hydraulics, you're encouraged to experiment and build to your heart's content. So if you have one takeaway from our little chat, let it be this. You can do anything at Ohio. Take it from me, an engineering major, film and business minor with a job in professional development. And that's all in the past year. Imagine what's possible in four. Gotta fly, back to you, Alex. Nice work, Ian. We can't wait to see the exciting machines and career you build in the coming years. It sounds like you found the perfect place to study and play at Ohio. Take care. Next up, let's meet Joy. Joy never imagined she'd travel so far from her hometown of Birmingham, Alabama for college. But in Ohio University's fun and welcoming residential and campus life, she found a home away from home. Over to you, Joy. Hey, y'all, and thanks for that introduction, Alex. Growing up in Alabama, I always thought that I would go to school in the South. I'm the oldest of four, and I wanted to be a good role model for my siblings. I graduated at the top of my class and also a student body president. It wasn't until my advisor at College Prep U introduced me to Ohio that I decided to apply, and I'm forever grateful for that. Finding my community was essential. As a freshman, I'm already involved in organizations, including Ebony Minds, the African Student Association, the Black Student Communication Caucus, and UCC, the Underclass and Connect, which helps new multicultural students get more connected on campus. Without a doubt, my favorite place on campus is the Multicultural Center. The staff there feels like family. I can go there for support, or if I even just want to hang out between classes. Ohio's unique approach to the residential experience allows for students to see and live alongside people with common interests and goals. Honors and Scholars, LGBTQ, and Links program housing for first-year multicultural students are just some of Ohio's specialized housing experiences. Our dining hall offers options that fit people from many different backgrounds, vegan, gluten-free, and international dishes, to holla-friendly and locally sourced ingredients. 
Ohio is split into five unique greens. North, South, West, and East have residence halls. And you'll visit College Green on your way to class. South Green is home to a Ping Recreation Center and the football stadium. Across from West Green, you'll find the Convocation Center, where many indoor sporting events are held. East Green's infamous Jeff Hill leads you to North Green, where you'll find academic buildings and Hudson Health Center. Coming from Alabama, I was afraid that I wouldn't find my community, but that thought quickly went away. The many experiences that Ohio has given me have been nothing short of amazing. That's my story, Alex. Back to you. Thank you, Joy. It sounds like Ohio's intentionally small residence halls help build tight-knit communities. It's easy to see why you feel at home right here. Thanks again for sharing your story. Now it's time to meet Casey. While she had visited Athens over the years, it wasn't until she discovered OU's emphasis on hands-on experiential learning that she realized this was the perfect place to prepare for a career in business. Tell us more, Casey. Thanks, Alex. My parents are Ohio University alumni, so I've been visiting this college ever since I was a little kid. When it came time for my college search, I thought about not attending Ohio University because I wanted to be different than my parents. But when I stepped onto campus during my freshman year, my perspective about this university completely changed. My favorite part about Ohio University is the size and ability to get involved on campus. The classroom size is fairly small, so it's really easy for you to get to know your professors and classmates. My teachers also get to know me outside of the classroom through organizations like the Select Leadership Development Program. We participate in leadership curriculum, executive engagements, and travel for networking trips. I recently traveled with the organization to San Diego to meet with Ohio University alumni and additional corporate executives. Now, they are part of my professional network and I was able to learn about their leadership styles. I've been able to meet with dozens of companies and learn more about my career field during my time in Select. I also am a part of the Fixed Income Management Group. We trade over $3 million of the school's funds in fixed income securities. I'm getting real world experience in investments and how to operate Bloomberg terminals. Both of these groups have helped me build on my professional and technical skills through curriculum and networking events. Plus, these experiences have helped me get interviews for internships. Without these organizations or the support from my professors, I never would have gotten the opportunity to have two different internships or an offer for a full-time job after graduation. Bobcats Help Bobcats isn't just something that we say. The faculty at Ohio University understand your goals and will support you until you achieve them. That's my story. Back to you, Alex. Wow, congratulations on your job offer even before you graduated too. It's wonderful that you found a place that helped you turn your passion into marketable real world skills. It sounds like Ohio helped you launch what's sure to become an exciting career. Thanks again, Casey. Now we're gonna hear from Salu. His story really drives home how experiential learning isn't just emphasized in Ohio University's curriculum, but through co-curricular activities like campus organizations as well. Go Salu. Hey everyone. Growing up, I had one school in mind for college. And once I visited that school, I absolutely hated it. That sent me back to my drawing board and I started my college search all over again. Fortunately, that worked out for the best because it led me here, to Ohio University. Coming to a new school for orientation can be a very scary thing. One thing that stuck out to me during my orientation was the idea of a Bobcat family. The faculty make intentional connections with the students here. We're not just numbers. As a pre-med student, I've been able to connect with fellow students and faculty in my program, and those at Ohio University's Heritage College of Osteopathic Medicine. These connections also gave me access to a mentorship program that feels special, and I know will further my career. There's no shortage of organizations to join on campus. For me, that includes the Microbiology Student Organization, Student Alumni Board, the Housing and Residence Life Council, and the Fencing Club, which is advised by my physics professor. These are just four of the 600 plus student organizations that our campus has to offer. If you don't end up finding the group or organization for you, 
Make your own. No matter what you create here, you will find your people. Here at Ohio University, you have the whole community of Athens cheering you on. Not just the professors from your major or your friends, but also the Athens locals who love to hear about your experience. This support helped me choose the right medical school and career path. That's it for me. Let's throw it back to you, Alex. Thank you, Salu. You're not alone. So many students may have a college in their mind only to visit and realize it's not the perfect fit. From faculty who support you to mentors in your field and student organizations, Ohio ensured you made connections that count. And that's awesome. Take care. Okay, everyone, I am so excited to introduce you to Sarah. Like many prospective students and their families, Sarah was looking for a university where she could connect to opportunities like scholarships and internships that would help her not only thrive now, but prepare her for a career. She found that right here at Ohio. Tell us all about it, Sarah. Thank you for coming to my beautiful campus. In high school, I wanted to study philosophy. I was lucky enough to get into the Cutler Scholars Program, providing a full ride to Ohio University. This is a scholarly program for students wanting to make positive impact in their communities, and I was ready to do just that here at OU. Ohio has given me the opportunity to study abroad and internships. So far, I've completed five internships. Currently, the two internships I have are with the Office of the Director of National Intelligence. The other is with Data Robot, where I'm an engineering intern working on how to mitigate bias and discriminatory factors in algorithms and data sets. These amazing opportunities allowed me to discover my passion and to refine my skills, making me the person I am today. That's exactly what OU does. They help you find your path and guide you through it. Ohio University is a university that helps develop and promote the town and gown spirit. They prepare us academically, but also encourage us to become good stewards of our community. For example, I'm one of two student representatives on the Ohio University Board of Trustees. I also work with the Mount Zion Preservation Society, which is fighting to prevent the eraser of Black history here in Appalachia. OU has taught me how to carve out my own unique path as a multifaceted person who can excel in their career, but not at the expense of ignoring my humanity. Now back to you, Alex. Wow, Sarah, it sounds like Ohio definitely helped you find your path and connect you with your future. You certainly have what it takes to excel at any career you pursue. Thanks again for sharing your story. Take care. Okay, next, let's hear from Sydney. Sydney's plan after graduation is to continue on to law school. At Ohio, Sydney found a multi-layer support system designed to help every student graduate on time, on plan, and prepared for whatever comes next. Over to you. Thanks, Alex. Ever since high school, I knew I had wanted to go to law school. I chose Ohio University because of its amazing programs and options for supporting students both in and out of the classroom. I'm heavily involved in our Center for Law, Justice, and Culture, as well as several student organizations here. The Center provides amazing support for students who are interested in both legal and human rights fields. In a study abroad program I went on as a freshman, I was fully immersed in the social and political discourse of Northern Ireland, and it strengthened my ability to conduct research on another culture. In addition to the CLJC, academic advising is readily available to ensure that you take advantage of opportunities but can still graduate on time. From my intro to sociology professor all the way up to our university's president, faculty have open office hours to provide support. My student organizations here are my lifeline. I'm a sociology and economics major who loves singing and dogs, and OU has organizations that allow me to be involved in all of those things while still building professional skills. The Picardy Thirds, or P3 for short, they're my family, and I absolutely love getting to sing with this a cappella group. Shameless plug, we do hold auditions every year. 
Four Paws for Ability is a great way to have a dog while in college because the program pays for food, supplies, vet visits, and grooming. All you have to do is provide the foster with the love and support needed to become a service dog. Law school is still my plan after graduation. I love that I can have both experiences that aid in my academic success and experiences that allow me to continue to do the things that I love. This school has given me so many memories that I will cherish for the rest of my life. All right, what's next, Alex? Thank you, Sydney. It's refreshing to hear that Ohio offers the kind of holistic support and well-rounded student experience that help make college and your future career more successful. That was great, take care. Up next, we'll meet Isabel. While it was important to her to find a university with rigorous academics and a strong honors and scholars program, she didn't want to sacrifice the classic college experience or community. At Ohio, she learned she didn't have to choose. Okay, Isabel, what's your story? Thanks, Alex. During my college search, I hoped to find a university which placed as much emphasis on personal development as it does on technical skills and academic rigor. With Ohio University's many honors and scholars programs, it has been easy to find resources which do exactly that. Coming to Ohio University from Kentucky, I worried that I would struggle to find community. I joined a learning community, which allowed me to meet my classmates in a safe and welcoming environment. I enjoyed the experience so much that I have since served as a learning community leader to foster those connections for new Bobcats. I have also had the opportunity to practice professional skills while guiding first year students by serving as a TA for the Ohio Honors Program's Engagement Lab, which allowed me to take on a hands-on international service learning project. When I'm not mentoring first year students, I often find myself in one of Alden Library's seven floors with ample study rooms, a cafe, and tutoring through the Academic Achievement Center Alden serves as a one-stop shop for productive work sessions. As a Margaret Boyd scholar, one of my favorite spots in Alden is the Nevertheless She Persisted Through Time exhibit, honoring her, our first female graduate. Ohio offers a broad range of honors and scholars programs. From academic programs, like the Honors Tutorial College, where students dive deep in their majors in personalized tutorials, to a wide range of multicultural scholars programs. Additionally, the Voinovich Scholars Programs caters to undergraduate students dedicated to research. Ohio is dedicated to recognizing its outstanding students in addition to supporting them personally and academically. Annually, OU honors leadership and community service through the Leadership Awards. I was delighted to receive the Hispanic Heritage Achievement Award. I have loved participating in several honors and scholars programs during my time at Ohio University and look forward to ushering in the next wave of high achieving Bobcats. Back to you, Alex. Thank you, Isabel. While many colleges offer some form of learning community, it's amazing that 98% of students at Ohio University participate in one during their first year here. It sounds like that's just one of the many ways students find the exact programs and people to make their Ohio experience very special. Thanks for sharing the story. Now let's meet Ella. Originally from Portland, Oregon, but with family roots right here in Ohio, Ella was looking for a university experience that emphasized and partnered with the community while offering plenty of cultural opportunities across the region. What better place to find that than right here in Athens? Right, Ella? Thanks, Alex. I've always been passionate about my education. While my hometown is Portland, Oregon, my parents grew up here, and I wanted to spend the next stage of my life connecting with my Ohio roots. As a recreation management student with the Patton College of Education, I've been working with the Athens County Convention and Visitors Bureau in events and marketing, giving me a hands-on opportunity to use and expand my skills. The most exciting part has been planning local events like the Taste of Athens County Food Festival, from the ideation to the planning process, something I never thought I'd be doing as a student. Not only do university jobs and placements provide opportunities for leadership roles and growth, 
I've also met so many lifelong friends. Beyond unique internship placements, Ohio University has many other experiential opportunities for students, such as the Bobcat Seed Fund. Since 2018, any Bobcat entrepreneur can apply for a grant to begin or grow their own venture, giving Ohio students the opportunity to jumpstart their future career. In my spare time, I enjoy the university-owned Athena Cinema, a movie theater just a short walk from campus. The cinema is currently in their ninth year of showing the sustainability series in partnership with the Environmental Studies Program and University Libraries, among other groups. The series offers free admission to informative films and provides space for discussion among students and community members. The Athena also hosts the Athens International Film and Video Festival in association with the university and many other community groups. Thanks. The festival provides a platform for underrepresented filmmakers and unique viewpoints from short form to documentaries. When I began my education at Ohio University, I'd never imagined myself where I am now. I went from being an undecided freshman to a senior with unique learning experiences and plenty to build up my resume. Thanks to my time here, I feel more deeply connected than ever to my family, my roots, and my future career. That's all from me. On with the show, Alex. Thanks, Ella. It's so cool to hear how Ohio University gave you the chance to feel more connected to your family, your community, and your future. With so much natural outdoor beauty here in the Appalachian foothills, it's no surprise that Ohio University is a leader in population health and sustainability. Andrew is an outdoor enthusiast who found the perfect place to live, learn, and play right here at Ohio. Over to you, Andrew. Thanks, Alex, and hello, everyone. I've always loved the outdoors and staying active. What better place to experience it than at Ohio University? Coming from out of state, I fell in love with campus during my first tour. As a wildlife and conservation biology student, I have had the chance to explore my interests both in classes, such as comparative vertebrae anatomy, as well as in the field, where I study the health of frog and toad habitats. Ohio University is a leader in conservation and sustainable efforts. Locally, with our amazing Climate and Sustainability Ambassadors Program, as well as globally, through collaborative research programs. As the learning community leader for first year environmental and plant biology students, I helped students explore these opportunities when we visited places like the greenhouse and the campus farm, as well as the ridges hiking trails located right on campus. With places like the Land Lab, Grosner Hall, and Irvine Hall, there is no shortage of places to study and work. Since Ohio University is located in beautiful Athens, Ohio, students also have the chance to get outdoors at places like Stroud's Run State Park and Hawking Hill State Park. Students also have the chance to purchase fresh local produce at our farmer's market, as well as our own student farm, and to stay active indoors at King Recreation Center or outdoors on our many hiking trails, including the Hawk Hawking Athena bike path. When I entered college, I never expected to teach a learning community, to conduct research in a national forest, or to train over 20 volunteers. But Ohio University gave me these experiences and so much more. They gave me lessons and friends to last a lifetime. Thank you for listening. Back to you, Alex. Thanks for sharing your story, Andrew. It's clear that Ohio's unique location gives students opportunities to study communities and habitats they can only find in this very region. And what a beautiful region it is. Thanks again for sharing. Let's make our way over to meet Ryan. From his first day on campus when Ohio's incoming students walk together as one class through Alumni Gateway, symbolizing their entrance to life as a bobcat, he fell in love with OU's school spirit. Go Ryan. Thanks Alex. Music has always been the center point of my life. So I knew I wanted to pursue a career teaching music in public schools. Ohio University's School of Music stood out to me as the best place for me to become an excellent music educator. 
Being here has been the experience of a lifetime. I've connected with peers in my major with countless opportunities to involve myself in campus organizations. The one I'm most involved with is the Marching 110. First nicknamed after the original number of members in the band, today, 110 symbolizes the 110% of effort always expected of its members. We're known for our unique marching style and choreography, and we've performed in over 40 NFL halftime shows, Carnegie Hall, Macy's Thanksgiving Day parades, and even international venues. With our exciting style and one-ton pride, sometimes even the other team's fans can't help but stand up and shoot. Go, Ohio! And when I became an official member, I knew I had found my new family. Besides packing the Ozone student section at home games, Bobcats show their Ohio love by supporting our 16 NCAA Division I athletic teams, participating in club and intramural sports, enjoying special spirit weekends like Homecoming and Sibs Weekend, and performing in or attending creative performances by students and faculty, like the Tantrum Theater, where fine arts students get stage experience with a professional company. I have three more years here at Ohio, but already my college experience has been amazing. I'm set in a solid path for my career, having the time of my life marching in the most exciting band in the land, and cheering on my fellow Bobcats with my new friends. Whatever path you choose at Ohio, this place and the Bobcat spirit will stay with you forever. Back to you, Alex. Thanks, Ryan. The Marching 110 is truly a highlight of any Ohio game or spirit event. Congratulations on becoming part of the most exciting band in the land. Wow, you can't really step onto the Ohio University campus without feeling that special Athens magic everyone talks about. I can tell this place and the warmth of this unique community will stay with me long after I leave. I think I'm starting to understand that's what students and alumni mean when they say they're forever Ohio. Thank you to all the Ohio University students, faculty, and staff for welcoming us here today and sharing their stories on campus with us. And while this episode is now over, your Ohio journey is just beginning. Take time to research this place. Ask a Bobcat alum about their experience, or better yet, see this beautiful campus for yourself on a visit. These students and this hands-on approach to learning and leadership are truly remarkable, and they're ready to welcome you just as they have welcomed me. Take care, everyone, and go Bobcats. Cheers.